Hey everyone. How's everyone doing? Well, I hope you're doing well. Um, so for today's Saturday class, we welcome everyone. Um, I hope you all had a great week this week. And um, for today's workout, we will need um, the platform, one to two sets of bands, and the workout bar. Um, and I'm going to kind of go over the workout um, while more people join us because it's still just 10. So we'll wait till about like 10.05 before we begin our workout. But um, yeah, so you'll just need the platform, one to two sets of bands, and the workout bar. Um, so you can see I have mine kind of set up here. Um, just go ahead and screw your workout bar together. Um, so for today's workout, we're going to be doing a lot of overhead stuff. Um, just to give, give you another perspective on some of the exercises that you can do. And um, I noticed last week some of you were mentioning that you wanted the workouts to be longer. So I'm going to go ahead and do, instead of the three sets we normally do, we'll go ahead and do four sets. Um, today I plan to really work you guys out. Um, we're going to have a great workout today. We're going to kill it. We're going to get some muscle. Um, all right, we're probably going to be sore tomorrow. Let's just say that. Um, so we're going to start with overhead squats. So obviously you'll have your one to two bands in. I'm personally just going to use one set today because I feel it with one set. Um, if I need to, I can tighten my band so I can put it instead of just clip to one or clip to two. I can put it through one, clip to three, clip to four, etc. So, but first thing first, we're going to go ahead and do overhead squats. So we're going to have the bar up over our head. And if you need to, if that is too hard, go ahead and put the bar right here, right on the front of your shoulders like this. Um, so we're going to start with that. And we're going to do 10 reps here. So we're going to go down as far as we can, but we're going to keep a feel like, Imagine a string from the top of your head all the way down through your body to the floor. You want to make sure that that string is straight the whole time. So that'll give you good posture and uh, good squat form. You don't want your chest to bend forward or backward. You want it in that, that center. So that think of that string just pulling it up. So you want to, so we're going to do 10 reps there. And then we're going to go ahead into overhead lunges. And then we're going to go right into pop squats. And then we're going to go into another kind of lunge where you, and you kick up, really squeezing that core. Um, so that will be really good to activate your core muscles and your legs. And then we're going to go ahead and do high tempo um, high pulls. So, and that'll be our burnout. So we'll get there and I'll show you how that's done, but um, we'll do that for about three to five minutes and burn out on that. So let's go ahead and get our body boss set up. And it's about 10.03, so I hope more people have joined us. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and get our body boss set up. So I am gonna go ahead and put my, my bands in descending 12. So through one, clip to two. Because you want to get it in a setting that you feel comfortable being able to lift it up over your head. Because these are kind of challenging. So today will be a really good workout. And if it's too challenging, like I said, lower the bar. Put it on the front of your chest or behind your, behind your head, on your neck, behind your, on your shoulders there. So I'm putting my bands in setting 12. So through one, clip to two on each side. There we go. And go ahead and test it out. See how it feels up over your head. I feel tension. I feel it feels really good to me. I'll do a practice squat. It feels really good. So that's what I'm going to do for my workout. Um, you might just have to clip it into one and lift it up over your head. If that's too hard, like I said, put it right here or put it on the back of your so you can do your reps. What matters with the body boss is that you get your reps in and it's difficult for you. If it's if it's too difficult to lift it up over your head after number five, go ahead and put it on your shoulders. Finish your set. That's the whole point. Finish strong, okay? 
So we're gonna go ahead and get started with our workout because it's 10.05 now. So um, we're gonna start with overhead squats. And we're gonna superset these with our overhead lunges. Um, so we're gonna do 10 and 10, and we're gonna do four sets of the superset, okay? So this is gonna be challenging, but we got this. We're gonna do our best, and we're gonna really push ourselves today. So go ahead, put the bar up over your head. Think of that string going through your head, all the way through your body, and keeping your body nice and aligned. So go ahead, we're gonna start. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good job. So right into the lunges. So when we do our lunges, you want to make sure that you always have a foot on the base. Because otherwise, the base is going to come flying up at you. So make sure you always have a foot on the base and keeping your body weight on the base. And we're just going to be touching our back foot out. So one, one, two, two. Think of that string. Three, three, four, four. Five, five, six, six, seven, seven, eight, eight, nine, nine, ten, ten. Very good. So I hope you guys felt the burn on that one. I definitely did. Um, you should feel it in your shoulders, your legs. It should be getting your heart rate up. You're breathing a little bit more heavy. So, very good. Go ahead and get a drink. Take like a 10, 15 second break. <clears throat> okay. So, we're going to do three more sets, just like that. Um, and then we'll get into our next exercises. So, you felt the bands were too hard, too difficult in setting 12? Go ahead and put the bands to just one. Try it with just one. Worst case scenario, at around number five or number six rep, you can go ahead and bend your arms and just put it on the front of your chest or on the back of your neck here, like you're doing a regular squat. So, okay. All right, so let's go ahead and get started. So about feet shoulder width apart. We're gonna put the bar up over our head. Think of that string pulling you straight aligned. Nice and straight. All right, let's get started. Three, two, one. One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Very good. We're going to get right into lunges. So remember, keep that foot on that base. And keep thinking about keeping your body nice and pulled up. Like there's that string going all the way through your body and pulling you straight up. All right, ready? One, one, two. Two, three, three, four, four, five, five, six, six, seven, seven, eight, eight. Come on, two more. Nine, nine, one more. Come on. Ten, ten. Very good. That was great, you guys. We got two more sets. We're gonna do it. We're gonna really work hard today. Go ahead and get a drink. <clears throat> Woo! I'm feeling the burn. All right. 
So we'll wait about 10 more seconds, and then we'll go ahead and get started with our third set. So it's really good to have a break in between sets, but you don't want it too long of a break. I would say keep it under a minute. Um, if you need to, you could go over that, but when you feel like, okay, I'm not extremely fatigued anymore, I'm still tired, that's the perfect time to go ahead and get started with your next set. Because that gets your heart rate up, it gets you stronger, better endurance. So really push yourself on keeping the sets, in between sets, um, the time, keeping it under a minute or so. So let's go ahead and get started. All right, shoulder, or feet shoulder width apart, um, bar up. Think of that, that string pulling you up, straight up. We're gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Very good, right in the lunges. One, one, two, two, three, three, four, four, five, five, six, six, seven, seven, eight, eight, nine, nine, one more, come on, ten. Ten. Very good. That was great, you guys. Good job. All right, get a drink. About 15, 30 seconds. And we'll get started into our last and final set. And we're gonna push ourselves. So keep keep that positive mindset. You're gonna do great. You can do anything you put your mind to. All right. All right, guys. So we're going to go ahead and get started. Um, remember that string, pulling you straight up, keeping that back nice and straight, and really keeping your posture perfect for the workout movement. So feet shorter width apart. All right, let's go ahead, lift our bar up over our head, and get started. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Great job. Okay, let's go ahead and get started right in the lunges. So, 10, 10. Nine, nine, eight, eight, seven, seven, six, six, five, five, four, four, three, three, two, two, one, one. Great job. That was awesome, you guys. Good job. So that was our first super set. Um, go ahead and get a drink, and then we'll get into the next exercise. <clears throat> Woo! I hope you guys have a sweat going. I definitely have one. Um, so our next exercise is pop squats. So it's kind of similar to the movement we were just doing. So we're already fatigued. So we're gonna finish strong on this. We're only gonna do three sets of 10 of these. Um, so it's just to re, um, reify the movements we just did. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna have the bar here and we're just gonna pop squat. So you squat, pop, squat, pop, squat, pop. And we're gonna do three sets. We've done these before, um, but these are one of my favorite movements actually, because it's a full body movement, and you're getting your heart rate up. It's great. So let's go ahead, 
Get your feet shorter width apart. Um, remember that string the whole time. That's our goal today, to keep that string through our head, through our body, all the way down, pulling it all the way up. So you keep that good posture and really save your back. So I start with the bar right on my front shoulders here. So we're going to go ahead and start here because we're going to go pop, okay? So let's do 10 reps. Ready? Three, two, one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Great job. All right. So we'll do about 15 second rest. And we'll get started on our uh, second set there. And we're just going to do three sets of these. All right, get a drink if you need. Yeah, wow, well, I really want to push us ourselves. We really want to push ourselves today. So it's Sweat Saturday. So let's go ahead and get started with our next set. We're going to do 10 reps. Um, so the head, if you need to adjust your mans. I'm going to keep mine in setting 12 through one, clip to two. All right, ready? We're going to get started in three, two, one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Great job. Now I really feel the burn in my shoulders and my quads here. And just it's getting my heart rate up. I love this movement. It's really a good movement. You can make a whole workout around this movement. So we're gonna go ahead, get started with our last and final set here in about 10 seconds or so. So adjust your bands as needed, get a drink as needed. Okay, all righty, let's go ahead and get started in three, two, one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Great job. So that concludes our pop squats. We're going to go ahead and get a drink. And we'll get started into the next movement. And we'll have to adjust our bands on that. Um, they're actually called, um, I call them Jay's lunges. Um, so basically, you're going to be lunging. You're going to have the bar behind your head here. Here, I'll just show you. I'll have to adjust my bands, but you're going to have the bar behind your head. And you're gonna go ahead and you're gonna lunge, do a normal lunge, but then when you come up, you're gonna bring that knee up. You're gonna target that core, those core muscles and really activate the core muscles to get a nice, nice cut lean abs. So go ahead and get a drink. <clears throat> okay, so. We're gonna do four sets here. Um, so four sets of J's and lunges, um, one one, so one on each leg, um, and then we'll get started into our finisher. I hope you guys are having a great workout. I am. I'm sweating. So let's finish this strong. So I'm gonna actually put my bands into setting um, 14. I'm gonna try and push myself today. Um, but you want to get it into a setting that you feel is um, pretty challenging. I mean, I think that this is to like, um, 14. I'm going to try to push myself. The whole point of this is to um, push yourself today and really get a sweat going. So, all right. So I put my bands, like I said, in setting 14. Through one, clip to four. It tightens the band. It increases the resistance. So... If you need to, go ahead and 
add bands. Say you're on setting 15, it's still too easy. Add another band. So that's the beauty of it. All right, so go ahead, put the bar up on the back of your shoulders here, and we're gonna go ahead and get started. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Great job. Now we're going to go ahead and do ten on the other leg. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one more, ten. Great job. Great job. So go ahead and get a drink. We're going to do three more sets just like that. Great job, you guys. All right. We'll take about another 10 seconds or so and then get started into our next set. mine the same. I really felt like that was a good setting for me. Um, so let's go ahead and get started. We're going to put the bar on the back of our neck here. And we're going to do 10 reps on each leg. So let's go ahead and get started. We're going to start with our right foot back and then kicking that right foot forward as well. So all right, one, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Great job. And when you kick your foot forward, make sure you really focus on squeezing those abs. So let's go ahead and get started with our next leg. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Great job. All right. That's great. I'm feeling the burn. I am. So go ahead and get a drink. We'll get started on our third set here just in a, in a few minutes, or I mean a few seconds. So. <clears throat> oh man, this is a good workout so far. I hope you guys are liking it. Um, adjust your pants as needed. Um, we're gonna get ready for our third set, and then we'll just have one more after that. And then we're gonna go into our finisher, which I'm really excited to do with you guys. So, today's workout was really focused on full body. Um, I really like to do full body workouts because I just feel more accomplished. Um, especially if you can't get to the gym or you work on your body boss, um, every day, you know, so it's a good way to get all those body parts and really focus on getting that proportion, um, look that you guys want. So you have to focus on everything. You can't neglect one area of the body and just focus on arms. You have to do legs as well, and core, and everything else. So let's go ahead and get started. Enough of my spiel. Okay, so let's go ahead. We're gonna, um, I'm gonna do 10 reps right here. One, focus on squeezing those abs. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten. Great job. Okay, let's go ahead and get started on our other leg. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Come on, you got it. Eight, nine, one more. Ten. 
Great job. Great job. Good job, you guys. We have one more set, just like that, of the lunges. So go ahead and get a drink. I am sweating out the storm. I hope you guys are. I hope you guys are liking this workout. At the end, go ahead and feel free to comment. Um, I'd love to hear what you guys think. Or if you guys have any requests, um, that would be a great time to let us know. Um, so, let's go. I'm going to catch my breath here. You guys are doing great. So, let's go ahead. Get ready for our last and final set of G's lunges. So, let's go ahead and get the bar up over our shoulders, on our shoulders here. And we're going to go ahead and get started. So, on the count of three, two, one. Starting with our right leg. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Great job. Let's go ahead. Go get right into our other leg. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Great job. Good job, you guys. All right. So we're going to take about 30 to 45 seconds, grab a drink, and we're going to get into our finisher. Woo! <clears throat> Wow. Woohoo. So with our finisher, we're gonna do high high temp um high pulls. So this is gonna be focusing on our shoulders and really our full body again. Um so we're gonna start, we're gonna go ahead and start with like the slow temp ones. So we're gonna just do 10 reps just like this. Really focusing on getting your delt um, on each side and just really controlled movement. And then we're going to get right into squatting down, putting it like right below our knees here, and then high pulling. And we're going to do those quick, high temp. So um, go ahead and adjust your bands. Um, as I did this, I felt like that was a good setting for me. I'm going to keep my bands in setting 14 through one clip to four. But adjust your bands as needed. You might need it at setting 13, setting 12. You might need more bands. So go ahead, adjust your bands as needed, and then we'll go ahead and get started. Okay. So in about 10 more seconds, we'll get started. I'll let those of you that are adjusting your bands get that taken care of before we start. All right, guys, we're going to go ahead and get started on the count of three, two, one. Nice and controlled. Up to your chin. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three, two, one. Great job. Now we're going to get right into the high temp ones. So we're going to go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good job. So we're going to wait about 15 seconds. We're going to do two more sets just like that. So, you should feel this really mainly in your shoulders. But with the popping, the pop, the high temp ones, it'll get your heart rate up as well because you're using your whole body. So, all right, I think it's been about 10, 15 seconds. We're going to go ahead and get started on our second set. So, all right, 
go ahead and we're gonna do 10 reps here 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 one, great job. Right in the high temp ones. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Great job. All right, get a drink. We're going to do one more set, and then that concludes our workout. So go ahead and get a drink, and we're going to really dominate this last and final set of today. So, <clears throat> you guys have done great. We've really pushed ourselves today. So, I hope you guys are liking the workout. Um, at the end, we'll do a little Q&A so you guys can ask questions or give me some suggestions on these Saturday classes. Um, and then we'll get to that here in a minute. So let's go ahead and finish our last and final set. So I like to have my hands, I put my thumbs on the bar, about an inch between my thumbs or two inches between my thumbs. And that's where I like to have my grip placement. So go ahead, we're gonna get started. 10, nine, eight, nice and controlled. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Great job. Right into the high temp ones. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten. Now hold it, hold it, hold it. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Great job. I threw that in it there at the end to really hold that position and really feel it in your shoulders. All right, guys. So that concludes our Saturday class for this week. I hope you guys really liked it. Um, if you can comment, go ahead and comment and let me know um, some suggestions or some questions that you may have about putting in your bands or what, anything. I'd love to hear. Um, I want to say thank you guys. Um, I really thank you guys for coming to today's class. Um, it's appreciated and I really hope that these are helping you. Um, you guys are our first believers and we really appreciate you guys. And we want you to know that. So let's see some of these questions. Oh, yeah, no problem. No problem, Diane. N no problem, Joan. No problem, Bethany. Thanks for, thanks for coming, you guys. I hope you guys are sweating. I am. I'm about to go drink like a five water bottles. <laughs> Focus on on your own workouts. So uh, Bethany asked uh, suggestions on what I should focus on in my own workouts. Um, so it really depends on what area you really want to target. Um, as I said earlier in the class, you do want to do full body. Um, you do want to work out your full body throughout the week. Um, you don't want to neglect areas because um, there's a saying that, like for, think about guys. They love to work out their upper body. They want that nice, tough look, those nice, big arms. Well, they can't get super big unless they have a big base. It's your foundation. So you need to work your legs, too. They have, they have to realize that they have to also work their legs. So it really just depends on the area that you want to work. Um, so if you're, like, targeting, like, maybe your legs, um, I would really focus on doing more leg um leg exercises throughout the week, maybe two to three times a week. Um, and even if it's just like 
um, I don't know what your fitness level is, but maybe do like three to five sets of 10 squats on the body boss. And then three sets of in between those sets, go ahead and do squat jumps off the body boss um, to switch up the movement. Um, I believe that if you're trying to target your legs, then um, really squats are one of the best movements and lunges. Um, I really feel like those really target all the muscles. Um, but if it's more upper body, maybe you want to do more upper body movements three, two to three times a week. Um, so like I would focus on bicep curls and I would focus on maybe overhead tricep extension. I don't know if you've used your door anchor at all, but you can really do some good movements with that. If you put your door anchor up on top of the door and you put your bands in, you can do pull downs and really get the, the tricep look that you're getting at. Um, so it really just depends um, on what body part you want to hit. What is the stitching coming? Oh, is it coming apart on your handle? Um, please let us know. Um, so take a picture of it and we'll have to get you a new handle because we don't want that breaking on you. Um, Mike, and then. Did you take the body bus to Florida? That's great, Mike. I'm glad you. Are you getting workouts on the beach? So I think that's all the questions and comments that we have for today. So thanks again, guys, for coming. I really appreciate it. Um, I'll be here next week. So I hope that you guys have a great week and come prepare next week. Um, we'll get an update out to you um, if there's any changes. But I, we want to keep these Saturday classes going. So no problem. You guys take care, okay? Have a great week. Thanks again for joining us.